In this video, I will show you how to send a welcome message to your Facebook leads on their WhatsApp number automatically. So what will happen every time a new lead is going to submit your Facebook lead generation form, an automatic WhatsApp message will get sent to the very same user. And for sending these WhatsApp messages, I'm going to use this Interact application, which has the access of the WhatsApp Cloud API. And in order to automate this process, I'll have to integrate Interact with the Facebook lead generation form form and I am going to integrate these two with the Pabli Connect. It is an amazing integration and automation software and I am an existing user of Pabli Connect. You can also create your free account in just two minutes from this sign up free button and in the free account you will also get free tasks to test this automation. Now once you will reach to the dashboard simply click on this blue button that is create workflow and provide any random name to your workflow to your automation. Okay, So I am providing the name as send welcome message on whatsapp to facebook leads okay to facebook leads okay okay let me also correct this spelling okay now after providing the name simply click on create and then you will notice two boxes in front of you so these are actually trigger and action so here trigger means when this happens and action means do this so whenever this happen then automatically do this understand with an example also whenever a sale happen in a payment gateway application then automatically send an email via gmail application okay so this is how you need to always select the applications in which you are building an automation according to our use case whenever any new lead is arrived into your Facebook lead ads into via your Facebook lead generation form then automatically send a welcome message and as I have told you for sending the WhatsApp messages I will use this interact application and now I am going to connect these two application with the Pabli connect to one by one okay so firstly choose a trigger event that is new lead okay you can even read the instructions that it will trigger when a new lead is submitted in a specified lead generation form associated to your Facebook page okay so I have selected Selected this trigger event simply click on connect simply click on add a new connection click on connect with Facebook lead ads and this is how provide the access of your Facebook account and this is how your Facebook account and Pabli connect will be connected immediately and once the connection is made we are going to test that whether this automation this connection is working fine or not how firstly you will have to select the page okay so let me take you to my Facebook account and here you can see I have created several pages and and in one of my page, I'm actually running Facebook lead ad. You will have to assume that I'm running a Facebook lead ad. Okay. But in actual, I'm actually into the testing mode. So these are not the live ads. Okay. So the name of the page is Pabli Tech. And let me show you that Facebook lead generation form, which I have created under this page. Okay. So simply click on this all tools section, and then you will have to search for the instant forms. All right. Here you can see instant forms. And after that, we are going to search for our form all right here you can see several lead generation form has been created and in this automation in this video i am going to use this particular form that is website form okay so here you can see this is the form looking for the digital marketing services or your company fill this form below and someone from our team will contact you shortly and from here exactly user can provide his details and using these details i am going to contact to my lead okay so come back to public connect and first read the instructions okay but how about I first to select my page that is Pabli tech and under this page I have created the form name as website form as I have told you as I've shown you just now okay so here you can see website form okay simply click on this button save and send test request all right I have done and here you can see it is actually waiting for the response okay so read these instructions that log into the application where you have added the web book URL and do a test submission or record so that the data can be recorded here in the webbook response okay so basically it is asking to do a test submission or record and here the test submission means creation of a new lead via this particular form so that the details can be collected via Pabli connect and you will also have to read these instructions also and visit this particular documentation in order to understand everything from the scratch okay so basically as I have told you that I am not running any live advertisement on my Facebook so how 
आई एम गोइंग टू जनरेट दिस डमी फेसबुक लीड एड ओके सो हेयर यू कैन सी अ टेस्टिंग टूल इज प्रोवाइडेड वाया फेसबुक आई एम गोइंग टू यूज दिस पर्टिकुलर टूल इन ऑर्डर टू जनरेट अ टेस्ट लीड सो हेयर यू कैन सी लीड एड्स टेस्टिंग एंड आई जस्ट नीड टू सर्च फॉर माई पेज दैट इज पैबली टेक एंड देन आई विल हैव टू सर्च फॉर माई फॉर्म ओके दैट इज वेबसाइट फॉर्म एंड लेट मी क्लिक ऑन दिस डिलीट बटन इन ऑर्डर टू चेक वेदर एनी एग्जिस्टिंग लीड्स आर नॉट एंड हेयर यू कैन सी योर लीड हैज बीन डिलीटेड आई एम गोइंग टू प्रिव्यू दिस फॉर्म एंड देन आई एम गोइंग टू सबमिट दिस फॉर्म ऑल राइट ऑल राइट सो दिस इज माई फेसबुक लीड जनरेशन फॉर्म एंड अज्यूम दैट द ई मेल ऑफ द पर्सन इज डेमो डमी एट द रेट टैबलेट यूज डॉट कॉम हेयर वी हैव द फुल नेम एज डमी यूजर एंड हेयर वी हैव द फोन नंबर नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू क्लिक ऑन दिस बटन एंड बेसिकली आई एम सबमिटिंग दिस फॉर्म देन आई विल कम बैक टू पैबली कनेक्ट एंड यू विल सी द सेम फॉर्म रिस्पॉन्स विल बी कलेक्टेड वाया पैबली कनेक्ट and here you can see the response is received let me show you the details one by one so here we have the same email address the same name the same phone number and we even have the created time okay so the presence of this data clearly shows that connection in between our facebook lead at form and pably connect is working absolutely fine now i am going to send a welcome message to that particular user on his whatsapp number but you must be thinking that this is not the genuine whatsapp number so how i will send the real whatsapp messages how i will show you this okay so basically i will replace this dummy number with my own whatsapp number the genuine number and then i will show you how messages can be received but for now we will proceed with the testing version only the testing number only and in the last before the whatsapp sending process i will change this number okay now i am going to connect interact with the pably connect just like i have connected pably connect and facebook lead generation form okay so simply click on connect Connect. Click on Add a new connection, and for the connection, it is asking for the secret key. Okay, so if you are already logged in into your Interact application, okay, you can notice the URL Interact. Okay, so if you are already logged in, after that, if you'll click on this particular hyperlink, it will directly redirect you to that specific page from where you can easily get this secret key. Okay, so I am already logged in, and here you can see I have also reached here into this Developer Settings. Okay, let me copy this. secret key come back to public connect paste the same here click on save and this is how my interact application will be also connected with the public connect now here you can see it as asking for a lot of details that is the country code the phone number and the full phone number now why it is asking the phone number at two different places so let me show you the note which is written over here important note it is mandatory to give a value for either full phone number or for both phone number and country code well it completely depends on that which kind of phone number you have okay so currently i have this particular phone number basically with the country code and with the plus sign okay so in that case i am going to provide the number into this full phone number field and just in case if i had not this country code in that case i will provide only the phone number into this specific field and then manually separately i am going to provide the country code here okay so let me provide this number and don't worry i don't need to manually copy the above details and paste it here i am going to map it mapping is very simple simply click on this particular field and you will find the above data of the step here in the drop down simply select that data this is how the data will be added and whatever the details you are going to map here these details will be replaced automatically when this automation will work in real time now it is asking for the template code name before i provide the code name firstly i will take you to the interact application and show you what are these templates okay so when Whenever you are using some official WhatsApp Cloud API for sending or receiving the WhatsApp messages to your customers to your clients, in that case, firstly you will always have to create a template, then submit it for the approval, then the Facebook company will approve your template, and then only you will be able to initiate the conversation with your customers using that specific WhatsApp template. Okay, so in this interactive dashboard, you can notice that I have created several WhatsApp templates. and uh, if i will click on the status you will see there are three status approved pending and rejected okay so basically the
टेम्पलेट्स मार्क्ड विद द ग्रीन कलर आर एक्चुअली द अप्रूव्ड वन द टेम्पलेट्स मार्क्ड विद द रेड कलर आर एक्चुअली द रिजेक्टेड वन एंड द टेम्पलेट्स मार्क्ड विद द येलो कलर आर द पेंडिंग वन एंड हेयर इन दिस पर्टिकुलर केस फॉर सेंडिंग दी वेलकम मैसेज आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस स्पेसिफिक व्हाट्सएप टेम्पलेट एंड आई हैव ऑलरेडी गॉट द अप्रूवल ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर टेम्पलेट नाउ फ्रॉम वेयर यू कैन क्रिएट दिस टेम्पलेट हेयर इज द बटन ऑफ क्रिएटिंग अ न्यू टेम्पलेट वॉट डिटेल्स यू विल हैव टू प्रोवाइड लेट मी शो यू ओके सो यू नीड टू प्रोवाइड द नेम ऑफ द टेम्पलेट देन लैंग्वेज देन यू विल हैव टू सिलेक्ट द हेडर विच इज ऑप्शनल ओके इन माई केस आई हैव नॉट सिलेक्टेड एनी हेडर जस्ट इन केस इफ यू वॉन्ट टू इंक्लूड एनी टेक्सट इमेज वीडियो और डॉक्यूमेंट अलॉन्ग विद योर हेडर अलॉन्ग विद द मैसेज ऑफ योर हेडर इन दैट केस यू कैन सिलेक्ट द सेम एंड फ्रॉम हेयर एक्जैक्टली वी कैन क्रिएट अ मैसेज ओके सो हेयर यू कैन सी आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस मैसेज हेलो डैश वेलकम टू पब्ली योर रिक्वेस्ट हैज बीन रिसीव एंड वन ऑफ आर टीम मेंबर विल कॉन्टैक्ट यू शर्टली एंड आस्क योर रिक्वायरमेंट मीन वेल यू कैन चेक आर वेबसाइट थैंक यू ओके सो यू मस्ट बी थिंकिंग दैट वॉट आर दीज नंबर्स पैक्ड विद द करली ब्रेसेस ओके सो वट एवर द डिटेल्स आई वॉन्ट टू कीप ऑन चेंजिंग ऑटोमेटिकली आई हैव स्पेसिफिकली केप्ट दो थिंग्स इन टू द फॉर्म ऑफ वेरिएबल यू कैन एड एज मेनी एज वेरिएबल्स एज यू वॉन्ट करेंटली आई एम इन टू द व्यू मोड सो दैट इज वाई दोज ऑप्शन आर नॉट विजिबल हेयर बट वेन यू विल क्रिएट द टेम्पलेट वेन यू विल एडिट दिस टेम्पलेट यू विल नोटिस द एड वेरिएबल ऑप्शन एंड इन फैक्ट सेवरल फॉर्मेटिंग ऑप्शन ऑल्सो ओके और राइट सो इन प्लेस ऑफ दिस फर्स्ट वेरिएबल the name of the customer will appear and here i can add the website name or the website link and here i will add the company name okay and using this single message only we are going to send a welcome message to all our leads okay and again footer and buttons are also optional in this particular case okay now i am going to copy the code of this particular template which you can take from the url that is welcome message xu okay come back to pabli connect and paste the same code here secondly it is asking for the language code okay so the uh, language code for english will be en and language code for the english us will be the en us okay in my case i have created the template with english language so i'll go with the en code okay so let me add en here and now it is asking for the header value so as i have shown you that i have not included any header along with my message so i'm going to leave this particular field blank lastly it is asking for the body variable values well this is the most interesting part okay so here exactly we will provide that what values will appear in place of these variables how we are going to provide simply read these instructions we just need to provide the values separated by a comma okay so i want that the name of the customer should appear into the first variable so let me map the name of the customer well it was something like demo i remember and okay here we have dummy user press a comma and then i am going to provide the value to my second variable and here i want that the website link should appear so i have already added the same and for the third variable i am going to provide the company name that is pabli team okay and here whatever the details i have provided manually the details will remain same and the details which i have mapped here will be replaced automatically and i have not included any dynamic url and the button so again i am going to leave these two fields blank now i am going to click on this button finally but before that let me replace my number with a genuine whatsapp number with my whatsapp number and let me also delete this existing message first all right so i have provided the number let me click on this button save and send test request and wait for the response to received and here you can see the response is received let me come back to my whatsapp web and wait for that message to be arrived here and here you can see the same message is arrived let me open that message in front of you hello dummy user welcome to pabli your request has been received and one of our team member will contact you shortly and ask your requirement meanwhile you can check our website thanks on the pabli team okay it should be actually thank you okay so make sure while creating the template you write the correct spellings all right so in this way now onwards every time you will get a new lead via your facebook lead generation form you can now automatically send a welcome 
message on their whatsapp number and not just to the facebook leads if you want to send the welcome message to your google ads lead to your linkedin ads lead in that case also this automation will work but in that case in place of facebook lead ad you will have to connect that specific application and in order to automate this process you need to create this automation inside public connect just once after that the messages will get sent automatically you can even close public connect sit back and relax okay so now onwards the this automation will work instantly and just in case if you want to access this automation inside your public connect account i will also attach this link into my description box you just need to click this link and sign up into the public connect and then you will be able to access this workflow this automation inside your public connect account that too for free not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with pabli connect you can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of pabli connect and for the latest updates of pabli connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formgate.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video